Well, another beautiful day today, full of sunshine and warmth as I open this window. Oh, look at this. It is so beautiful and so peaceful. Well, time to get on with the day. It's eight o'clock now. So I'll share with you what's happening today. Well, the filter's been changed on the lawnmower. So I'm going to cut all the verges along here, this over here, and along here where I can, and get this place looking neat and tidy. Grant has, and David are here, so he said he'll use the weed eater, or weed whacker, and do the edges for me. And I was grateful for that. So, and then I'll do the verges on the other side. So. Let's go and have a look so that you understand because I'm not going to film it, me cutting the lawn because it's going to take a long time for me to do this and I don't want to put a time lapse on it. So all this here will be cut along here and along there. I'll cut all that over there. And then on the ends of the driveway along the ends so yeah that's what i'm going to be doing today this morning well grant has painted these windows and they're now weatherproofed i can see what else he's doing wow oh, and david is repairing this floor oh. There was a big hole there because that asbestos pipe was there. So which windows have you done already? Upstairs? Uh, upstairs, downstairs, the three in there. So it's just the one in there. The hallway? No, yeah. that hallway there. Well, that one needs sanding and priming. Yeah. And that one there has been painted and needs... You've done that one down in the no, blue room? That's the one I need to do, the blue yeah. room. And then... I need to talk to you about the blue room, Dave. Oh, yeah, we need to call for that so we can paint it. Yeah, no, no, I want to tell you something else. Anyway, so David has now also varnished the floor. Don't, don't stand on it. I won't stand on it. No, no. Oh, my goodness, it looks beautiful. It looks stunning. So he's got to do that. And we're putting a piece of wood on this on this um, drawer and then it goes under the drawer that it fits under the basin. So we've got a little drawer for there. So all these things are coming together slowly. Let's go and see what he's done. So this one's been painted. Oh, so you just do one coat? One coat of glass for that. So it's all been weatherproofed. Wow. And my bedroom and the bathroom. Yeah, I think he's done. Yeah. Well, I've cut the grass here. So now it's all nice and tidy. I'll just get Grant to weed whack those or with a weed eater. And then I cut the verges. That was very difficult, but I did it. So we still got a weed, a weed eater around here. So this is all done. Everybody's working here today. And I'll show you what it looks like on the verge. Getting everything cleaned up for the winter. And then summer I can start. So there we go. The verges have all been mowed right up the hill. So it starts looking much neater. And all along the edge of the drive has also been done. So there's no big pieces done there.
yeah I'm happy with that David's done the floors it's all been varnished and it's like nearly dry and we took the basin out and he finished off the sanding there so and the drawer that goes in I don't want to lean in and I just one on the other side the drawer that fits in there has been repaired and this is what it looks like now so we've got a nice we've got a drawer now that will fit in there and I will varnish this all tomorrow and then he will come back and put the basin in for me and then this bedroom should be all finished this um, bathroom sorry should be all finished I just need to get the electric heater in there get one in there and then this will be perfect so I'm so chuffed with this drawer so that's all done now Great stuff, David. Well done. Now the hole has been filled up and um, we're not going to do anything with it at the moment because this floor needs to be sanded and varnished and then we will stain that piece to match up with the varnish that's the same as this floor. And now I don't have a big white board there anymore. So I'm quite chuffed with that. Now the hole has been filled up and um, we're not going to do anything with it at the moment because this floor needs to be sanded and varnished and then we will stain that piece to match up with the varnish that's the same as this floor. And now I don't have a big white board there anymore. So I'm quite chuffed with that. Well guys. We've come to the end of this week. This is the last day I'm releasing this vlog. It has been an enormous enjoyment for me making these, the seven day challenge. I've really so enjoyed it. I sincerely hope you've enjoyed it as well. Uh, it just, it shows you what a typical day is, uh, a typical week is like for me here at the Chateau. I'm always running around, always working, always doing something. And when it comes to the evening, five, six o'clock, I'm done. <laughs> when I've uploaded the vlog, I'm so exhausted that I just chill out and just enjoy the moment that I have achieved what the challenge that I've put forward to myself. If it wasn't for your encouragement and your wonderful comments, I don't think I would continue with this vlog. I think I've built up friendships with quite a few people online and it's just so wonderful to share everything with everybody. For me, it is just unbelievable that people are liking and subscribing to my channel some disappear others don't and it's to me enjoyment to create these vlogs and it encourages me to get on with the work that i need to do here it's just so, so beautiful to see how everybody stands by me. And um, oh, there are no words to describe it. The, do I continue with it? Or I think I might, I don't know. I haven't decided yet what I'm going to do. I think after this, I'm going to take two, break, two days off from filming to give myself some time to catch up with my paperwork 
and um, do the grocery shopping and get everything sorted out for the next week. And then I'll make a decision. And um, if you guys have got any suggestions, what you'd like to see um, and encourage me with anything that you enjoy, and I will attempt to do that as few of you already have given me encouragement over this week of what the vlogs you would like to see. So I hope you're going to enjoy this vlog that I've made. And if you would like to subscribe and share with your friends and tell them about my, vlog, my little channel that I've got here, I would be so grateful for that. And give us a thumbs up. It's just amazing. And the people that support me is just incredible. So I want to thank you all. Thank you, thank you from the bottom of my heart to the top of my head. It has just been wonderful. So next week, I'll put out a vlog. And in the meantime, if you want to send me comments of what you think, it'll be gratefully accepted. And we'll see you on Thursday. Bye for now and thank you.